Hello guys. So guys, today again I am with Scratch and uh, again I am showing you something interesting on Scratch. Why I am doing Scratch? Because most of the friends they and my students they ask me to do new things, new ideas on Scratch. So let's just start today. I am going to show you how can you create a story, a story on Scratch. So uh, let's start now. Okay, guys. So, so the first thing for the story, we are going to remove this cat. And uh, now I have to choose the characters. The first, you should know the story. What the story you are going to create. I am just showing you uh let's the story and um, i don't i didn't plan about this story but just i am giving you the idea but uh, when you will create the story so you have to plan what will happen the next scene uh the background will change the character will change some character will come in the story some character will remove from the story so uh what should be the dialogue for each characters so I will show you step by step. Okay, guys. So the first thing, as you know, uh, for the sprite for the character, you have to click on this sprite. This is for the sprite, and this is for the background. So first, we choose the sprite here, and uh, from here you can search the sprite. One more thing, if you want to upload, you can upload the sprite from internet or. Um, if you want to create your own character so you can use this paint or if you want to choose this character from here so you can make it from here so guys uh, now i am going to choose uh, any of the character from here suppose i choose this book filter okay he is the main character of my story and uh, after that, I have to choose the backdrop. Suppose I choose the backdrop, this one, desert. Okay. And uh, if you want to take another character, you can choose another character. Suppose I choose, uh, or you can write here, suppose princess. I choose princess here. We can choose the character size, uh, suppose 80, because she's too big or if you want to make it more so you can make it 60 okay now how she will say something so for this you know looks you will go to looks and say hello for two seconds okay so you can see now when i click on it but uh, what we have to do uh, when i click on green flag so as a green flag you go to events and take this green flag so when you will click on green flag she will say hello so this is the first character now the second character if you have to choose it uh, we go to the sprite again and we choose a character suppose this bear oh this is too big so i make it 50 and uh, because she's looking there so i will go to the costume and flip horizontal so now she's talking with me so this is the another character with this princess let's talk together so the same thing we will do with this uh, beer we will go to the looks and we will say hello princess And again we go to events and take this green flag so you can say now but uh, they are talking on the same time i don't want to talk on the same time just first the princess will say something hello and then the beer will reply so for this what will we do we will come to the princess and you can see now the princess uh, saying hello for two seconds so the beer has to wait for two seconds so what will I do I will go here on the beer and I will take this wait 
and I will make two here. So when you click some first, he is saying hello, and then he the beer is saying. Hello. So if I change here uh, three, so the beer, uh, sorry, uh, if I change here, the princess say in the three seconds. So I must change here. Also, he has to wait for three seconds. So you can see now after three seconds, the bear will say hello princess. So now, uh, suppose uh, now the Maya says hello and the bear said hello princess. And now again, the Maya want to say something else. So what will we do? We will take wait again for two seconds when he will finish. The bear will finish and after that the princess will say let's play so you can see now we done the program See, so now like this, the both characters can talk. Okay, now what if uh, we want to change uh, the background? Yani, uh, they don't want to play here. They want to play on another place. So see what will we do? So how we will change the background? You will go to the back backdrop. And then suppose uh, we take some sporty background uh, like this one. So now the question is how the, the scene will change when the Maya says let's play. So for this we will go to the looks and there is one option switch background to arctic because uh, this is it was desert before and now this is arctic so let's play hello hello princess let's play okay now it's not working so we have to see so it should start see hello Hello princess, let's play and the background will be changed, the place will be changed. You can see here now when I click on the green flag, the last background is coming, not the first background. So what I will do, I will go there to looks and again I will take switch backdrop to the first one desert and I will take when I click on green flag so it will be the forest and after that they are talking and they switch the background when she say let's play so you can see now okay so now we change the background the forest is coming in the beginning now when they come in the new place like in Arctic so the new character we want to edit. So we will go to the sprite. We will choose a new character. Like I take this guy. Or if you want to choose another one. So you can choose another one. Suppose this one crap. Okay. You can make it small. I make it 50. Okay, so when I run my uh, game, so you can see in the desert also there is the crap, but I don't want, I want the crap when I change the screen. So what will we do? We will go to the looks. There is show and hide. Hide will hide the character and show will show the character when I want. So what will I do? 
So what will we do? So you can see here in the events, there is one background fixed to background. So which backdrop I want when the grapple show? So the when the uh, backdrop switches to the forest or desert, it will be height. And when the backdrop like Arctic, the crap will be show. Let's check. See, it's not showing here. And once the screen, the backdrop will be changed, the crap will be appear. You can see now. So like this, you can appear some character in some scene, but not all, all the scenes. Because in the story, you don't want all the characters on the same time. So from this tool, you can use which character has to appear in which place, in which situation. Is it clear? Okay, guys, here one thing I want to tell you that now uh, suppose the crap will say something. But you can see now the princess will say two seconds and we have to calculate the three seconds after this. Uh, uh, the princess will say something and after that we have to calculate how much seconds that they will talk and they will change their backdrop and after that the crop will say something so this is very complicated so I will show you the easiest method how everyone cal can calculate or oh, everyone can talk on his time so the first way I told you about the weight and the second way is broadcast the message so what is broadcast message maybe you know and if you don't know so i explain you so broadcast message is hidden messages means everybody is talking but no calculation and very easily everyone can speak everyone can express his uh, feelings so from the broadcast now every character has the option or every character has the time when he receives the message from someone then he has to speak suppose uh, crap want to say something so when he will receive some message from the bear he will talk or the princess will talk to bear and the bear will wait for princess message now what will I do? I will take this broadcast message one when the Maya say this. So she broadcast her message. So now I will come to the crab and when the crab will receive the message one from Maya because message one now it's from Maya or from Bear. So when he will receive the message one she will talk say welcome welcome to Arctic let's check see now, when he received this message, he will talk. So now, uh, when Princess said something and uh, Crap received the message one, she, uh, the Crap replied. And now, when the Crap, crap said, welcome to Arctic, and it broadcast his message, now we have to make a message to suppose I say this is message 2 and I broadcast this and after this crab broadcast this message so after that bear will say something when he will receive message 2 then bear will say when he will receive this message message 2 when he receive message two, so he will say something, uh, whatever. Suppose I like this place. So let's check now. Hello, 
and hello pointers and now let's play now the screen has been changed and crap said welcome to arctic and then he said i like this place so some people use uh, wake block and some people use uh, broadcast both are correct but i think if uh, two, there are two characters so we can use wait but more than two characters so it's better use message so it will be easy for conversation okay so now you can create any story you can take any animated um, sprite and you can animate you can move it or it's depend on your story if you want to create your own character if you want to create your own backdrop I explained you before you can watch my previous videos and um, uh, you can use the animations also see there are the costumes so which costume you want to say means you want to show some uh, face uh, expression or bear expression or grab expression or you want to move some so you can use it easily and when uh, you have to save it and send to your friends or you want to create any of the story with conversation so you can do like this okay guys i hope you like this video so if you need some other software or other animated games so just tell me so i will explain to you if you did not subscribe my channel so please subscribe share with your friends share with your classmates so again if you need something else so just inform me Okay guys, take care. Bye.